I'm calling to inquire about a casino security job. Let's see how it goes. Thank you for calling Century Employment Group. Thank you. Our hours of operation Bastard. are 8 a.m. to 3 p.m. Monday through Thursday and 8 a.m. to 2 p.m. on a Friday. For Emmy, please press 13. For Lisa, please press 12. Your call is being transferred. This is Lisa. Yes, Lisa. I am uh, calling to inquire about your casino security position. Okay, yes. Yeah, uh, how many, uh, do you have any current openings at the moment? Uh, what is your background, young man? My background is, well, I've done security uh, on and off for about uh, the last 12 years. Uh, I've also worked on an armored uh, truck uh, situation. Okay. Yeah, we drove okay. around picking up and dropping off money. So I'm very uh, skilled in uh, handling cash okay. and whatnot. I do have openings. That's, uh, now, that's... you've called an employment agency, which means we do charge a fee to find you work. That's uh, that's great. Okay, how much do you charge? We charge you sixty-five percent of your first month income. Okay, that's uh, all right. Uh, you know, I uh, well again, uh, when I was on the armored uh, vehicle, I was able to uh, you know maneuver some cash out of there. I mean, there were certain ways where you would just you know accidentally forget to uh, you know drop a bag of money into the uh, the bank bag so we could take it to the bank at the end of the shift. You, you accidentally leave it behind in the truck, and then the following morning you take that, you th chuck it over the fence to uh, your your wheel man there, and he drives off with the money, and and nobody knows who took it. So I mean, I got a bunch of that kind of cash laying around. I figure I don't really need uh, that sixty five percent that you're going to take right at the moment. So, I mean, that, that sounds reasonable, perfectly reasonable to me. Let me tell you how we work. Okay. Uh, we do need at least a hundred dollar cash deposit before I send you out, but yeah. it is refundable if you're not hired. The, it's not refundable if I'm not hired? It is refundable. It, <laughs> it is refundable. It is refundable. It, That's... That's good, you know. You're not hired, yeah. I don't mind that, you know, uh, I, I've worked in a casino before, and, uh, so, I mean, normally at the end of the shift, there would be, uh, you know, some uh, some uh, men flirting with me and, and whatnot there at the casino. Uh, and, and again, at the uh, end of the, well, I, let me tell you this, at the end of the shift, I would go ahead and flirt back a little bit, uh, you know, ask them to meet me behind at the dumpster. And then right there, I'd, I'd pretty much, you know, jack them for all their money. So, I mean, you know, I'd demand their wallet, they'd give it to me. These, these were effeminate men. And so it was real easy to uh, mug them there. It was in New York. And so, I mean, I got a lot of that money laying around, too. I stuffed under mattresses and whatnot to purchase minute. illegal drugs. Have a background check? Any felonies? Any misdemeanors? No, well, let me tell you this. I mean, I've been yeah. charged I've been charged with uh, a few different crimes, but I've never convicted. So, I mean, clean record. I mean, yes, I have, uh, you know, I've, I've uh, jacked homosexuals for money out of their wallet. But, I mean, l l between you and I, I mean, they, they had it coming. I, again, they flirted with me. I mean, oh I am a... Well, let me, let me, let me tell you this. I'm a Christian man in the Bible, obviously against that, that kind of a lifestyle. So, I mean, Jesus is going to let me in those pearly gates. Uh, I'm doing the Lord's work when I beat down homosexuals. I'll tell you that. But, again, I've never been convicted of a crime, so I've got a clean record. Oh, man. Yeah. I mean, so, but listen, between you and I, I can tell you're a, a fine Christian woman. I mean, uh, you you must be against that that sort of lifestyle choice. I mean, if they were straight men, I would have left them alone, let them have their money. But, but I again, hurt anybody, I'll tell you that. Well, I didn't, I didn't hurt them badly. It's more like uh, something, a li little ice won't, well, a little ice on the eye there, and they'll be good in a couple of days, you know, it was that kind of a situation. Okay. So, I mean, you don't mind, right? I can go ahead, uh, you know, pay the deposit and we can get the ball rolling on this job? I'm not sure. They will check to see if you have any misdemeanors and they will turn you inside out, young man. That, well, that's, you much like those homosexuals. I'll tell you, I turn them inside out, you know. I shoved, I... I just work here. I sh yeah, well, I'm just saying, I shoved the bottle right up there behind me, and, you know, well, again, I mean, they pretty much had to come in. I mean, uh, the Lord does not appreciate that lifestyle choice. Okay, so, I mean, they had to come, again, though, they just sat there on a, probably sat on a bag of ice, healed their anus, and, uh, you know, probably good in a few days, and, you know, yeah, they lost a little bit of money, but they learned a valuable lesson, and they're probably with women right now. I probably turned their whole life around. 
and their body around from being bent over with their anus spread open for willing penis. So, I mean... Okay, I've had enough of this time. Well, wait, 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 wait. I do want this job, ma'am. I mean, I'm very serious. I got, I got the skills, the experience. I know, but you've told me much too much, honey. You really have. Well, I mean, it's between you and I. I'm not going to share this with anybody else. I just figured... Well, as yeah. long as you can pass a drug test and a background check, okay. Sounds it sounds good. So do I need to come in there or how does it work? I'm in tomorrow before tomorrow. one o'clock. Okay, that's I, I will do that and I will I will see you there. Okay. Thank you. Bye. <laughs> I just said I beat homosexuals, steal their money, robbed from my armor truck job, uh, all to just pay for bullshit, and she's still willing to hire me, as long as I give her some of my uh, blood money. Can you believe uh, the corruption in America today? Outrageous. Till next time, boom.